Good morning and welcome to Tuesday. Starting this morning off with um, toast and coffee. We actually just opened up the um, the fifth advent calendar uh, present gift from uh, Calvin and Bick, which was tuxedo shock socks. We didn't show it off yesterday, um, but yesterday we actually got, I don't know if you can see it up there, a little uh, Dragon Ball plush. It's cool. It's a little Dragon Ball plush with a dragon wrapped around it. We're going to be meeting up with Mark and Rhonda in probably like, what, like 60, 90 minutes? Yeah. Something like that. Oh, Mao. <laughs> Mao has been playing New Leaf again because uh, Pocket Camp came out. And you downloaded it, and you. How long did you play it? A little bit. <laughs> a little bit. A little bit, and then Mal became frustrated with the fact that it was so limited compared to what New Leaf and the other Animal Crossing games were. So she stopped playing Pocket Camp and got New Leaf again because you've never played it since that big Welcome Amiibo update. Yeah, I haven't. So it's almost like a almost like a completely new game, especially if you haven't played it in a while. So Mal's been really enjoying it, um, but I. I never actually downloaded Pocket Camp because I just felt that, like, for one, I wouldn't have time to actually play the thing, but also, I didn't, I don't want to say that I, I felt like it would be a disappointment, but I felt like it probably would not compare to, you know, the DS game, so I just never bothered, and now Mao is kind of in that boat where she's like, I just want to play New Leaf, so she's been starting to put some time into that. Yeah. It's fun. Yeah. It's fun. It's been a while since I've played Animal Crossing, but... When I played it, it was a really good time. I uh, don't know exactly what the agenda is, but we'll meet up with them uh, later, and then... You're trying, like, not to jump up into my plate. Here you go. Is that better? Problem solved? You're welcome. And what's the name of the place we're going? This one here on the corner. Amazing. Yeah, see, I... They're with Ama Zings. Yeah, I, whenever it first opened, I was like, Ama Zings? Having lunch at Z's Amazing Kitchen. Um, and also eating outside. I don't think we said what the temperature was today. It is December 5th. It is 70 degrees, and that is fantastic. You just have a BLT and... Is that mushroom soup? No, this is the blue crab soup. Oh. I'm disappointed. I thought you were going to get... <laughs> You're making fun of me. I am. <laughs> um, you got... What Southwest kind? chicken salad. Well, that looks good. It's very good. Mal had two tacos. Well, the other one was the ahi tuna. Is that... I have never tried that. that must, I'm, I want that piece. Okay, I'm claiming that for in a minute. Now I have a, I have a Cuban, which is very good. We also have a plan for today. I uh, finally figured out exactly what we're going to do. We're going to go to the Wax Museum. Uh, we've... How many years has that been in Myrtle Beach? A handful? We've never actually been, so we're going to go check it out. It used to be then, a restaurant. Yes, it did. Um, it's been a few things. And uh, then later tonight, we're actually going to go to a Christmas tree lighting ceremony that they're having. At the sports park. At the sports park, so that should be fun. We made it to the Wax Museum. I've never actually been to a Wax Museum, but it's kind of... It's kind of creepy. There's me and, me and Eddie Murphy. Short one. Will Smith is 6'5 in your life? Well, that's... Yeah, I'm 6'6", so I feel like Will should be up here a little bit. Yeah, as we start looking around, everyone feels miniature. Like, everybody feels really, really tiny. I mean, I don't know who is tall and who is not, but it feels like... Throw me the idol, I'll throw you the weep! Yeah, this one seems pretty good. I'm so glad that they chose to put Nicolas Cage in here. They should have They should have uh, used his scene from The Wicker Man. Something looks wrong with Vin Diesel. Like, his head looks miniature, but his, his arm is bigger than his head. I, I felt a lot of the characters' heads feel too small. Yeah. I think that's one of the... Characters. Yeah. Yeah, this is just kind of gross. <laughs> I could do without this one. <laughs> Look satisfied. <laughs> Vitamin Vegemite. That's a great episode. This one's just kind of cool. I like how uh, 
how big the the arm and the revolver are. This one's neat. Here's Martha Stewart, but where's Snoop Dogg? I know, right? <laughs> you don't see them without each other. Whoa! We're going. Not to come in if you expect a baby. Right. Because you'll be just I'll mortified. I'm shocked if there's a baby because right. I'm, I'm not expecting it. it. It's gonna jump out at me. That's a good predator. Yeah. Especially the eyes, man. The yeah. eyes are. I was thinking the teeth and the mouth. Eyes stare into your soul. Uh -huh. Alien. <laughs> God, that's really grotesque. I love it. If you want a pony and <laughs> a Red Rider and a BB gun. <laughs> that guy was the cause of so many nightmares when I was a kid. Yeah. My parents would watch it and I'd come into the room and it'd be on and I'd just, mm uh, nope, nope, nope. <laughs> That's just a beautiful face in general. I really like the monster section. I feel like the monster section's really well done. Leatherface, Elvira. Are you applying filter to the wax? the wax faces. <laughs> That's harder than it looks when I was on medium. Oh my god. You really? not want to have your friends. Okay. Wow, there's lasers all over. Party crawl. This is hard. <laughs> It's a lot of layers. You broke one. Now go and hold your hand on the next yellow checkpoint. Go and hold your hand on the next yellow checkpoint. <laughs> Bill Murray, who actually spends a good bit of his time in Charleston. He's been spotted around that area a lot. I mean, do you know how tall she actually is? No. Well, she might be that short. 5'2". Five 5'2". Two. Five two. So is that right? Yeah, she could be a little taller, but it's pretty she close. Oh, yeah. In the recent Morning Mario special, the 550 one, yeah. um, I, I, I did a joke with Hardy, and I'm not sure if anyone actually got it because it was a little, it was a little dated. The man in black himself, Johnny Cash, and also, yeah, Jolene. Little known fact about Jim Carrey, his feet are actually that big. The Sinatra looks really real. New friends every day! <laughs> this really does not look like Mel Gibson. At all. Not even a little bit. That one looks good. I wish that he was choking a snake though. Line! Line! <laughs> Is Matt Damon proportion wrong? Yeah, Matt, Matt Damon feels a little off. Matt Damon. Oh man, Eastwood's good. Yeah. I like that a lot. You wouldn't happen to know a Marshall James Anderson, would you? No? Okay. How you doing, Pilgrim? It looks like John Travolta just picked his nose and he's like trying to flick it off. Let me put my nose back. I am so glad that this is uh, this is Jeff Bridges and how he's portrayed. Whatever, it's just like your opinion, man. <laughs> Mom's spaghetti. I'm less interested in Owen Wilson and more in what he's about to eat. Don't worry, we have to say goodbye for now, but we'll be back. Lovely Hannah is trapped in a maze of mirrors, and we. We're imprisoned in this orb. Are you the chosen one? Yeah, that's me. Oh God, my, this is, this, oh. Oh, this is not good. I did, I did one of these in high school and I had to crawl through it. Uh, I'm really worried about this. 
this is critical today. Future rewards will come your way. Looking in there brings back so many bad memories. Oh, this is gonna be something. I feel like I have to hold my. Are you real? Oh crap! <laughs> I've never actually done one of these before. Oh. Okay. All right. I don't want to slam it. Oh, I'm already lost. No, that's me. Where? Oh, God. Oh, jeez. I'm coming. I'm coming. No, no, no. That's, this is all a dead end. This is all a dead That's also a dead end. Oh, my God. I'm... No. No, where did... Where did everybody go? Okay, so wait. Oh, I can see... I can see Rhonda down there. But if I can see straight down there, I can... does that mean I can walk? No. Oh my god, this is so confusing. You see, I can see you, but you can't be there. You must be somewhere else. Now. Ah! Hi. Oh. Hi. Woo. This isn't me. Really? Are you sure? <laughs> That looks fun. And disorienting. You're getting close. Please save me. I, I see you, but where, how I get to you, Hannah? I'm the You're getting close. Please save me. No. <laughs> well, you found the galaxy room. I guess so. But this, uh, this is, or is that, is that, maybe that's where we go. Thank you, Jason One. Okay. Our gratitude is boundless, chosen one. For today, you have saved our daughter and demonstrated that true beauty is always in the heart. Oh, we did it. Let's the ceremony. You want chip? No, I'm good. Oh. <laughs> but what if I. You don't want chip? Make it rain. Anyway. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, one. you're getting a chip. <laughs> I was so excited about that I got to keep these chips. I know. <laughs> I, just, I had one chip and threw them all on the house. Oh man, I hope I caught that. <laughs> you just it would you'll just see chips fly up into the Oh I hope you did too. Yeah. I probably did. Embarrassed myself a little bit. <laughs> There's an eighties video arcade. Oh yeah. You wanna go there? It is actually really neat. Okay, let's go. I did it like this. I did it like that. I did it with the wiffle ball bat. Parking to the left. Thanks. Can y'all hear me? 
welcome to the official tree lighting tonight for the city of North Myrtle Beach. We are so glad. Yes, let's put our hands together and make a little bit of noise. You could not ask for a more lovely evening. Uh, enjoy it because uh, before leaving the uh, radio station, I, I checked the weather forecast. It's going to be ugly. Uh, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, it'll be raining and highs at 48. Now, some people think that's very festive and Christmassy. I prefer sunshine. Do you have any food? I'll just eat your hand. That's not candy. Is he coming? He's, he's coming? He's coming. I don't know if he'll come without a little noise. He's coming. Run. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Santa Claus is coming to town. Man, that was a lot longer than I thought it would be. It said 5.30 on the website, so that's when we got here. And it was 45 minutes before they lit that tree. Closer to 50. Anyway, I'm sure the drive through is lovely. Yeah, yeah. This they they decorate the park and you can drive through here, but uh, you know tonight they do the tree lighting. I've never actually been to the tree lighting for North Myrtle Beach, so this is you know an interesting thing. Did everyone have fun? <laughs> All right. <laughs> yeah, the children were. It was hard to hear because the children don't enunciate very well, and it sounded like one of the songs was "Exile the Reindeer." But Rhonda looked it up, and it was eight tiny reindeer. <laughs> eating a lot of beef. Eating a lot. Yeah, I heard ex exile the reindeer. They eat a lot of beef. <laughs> that was not the lyrics, unfortunately. Anyway, uh, we're going to meet my parents for dinner. And uh, tell them all about what, <laughs> the, what they missed. <laughs> they really... They look forward to next year. Oh, yeah, they really missed out. <laughs> so we met up with my parents, and we came over to um, International Kitchen which we've been to a few times. It's a Polish restaurant, and there's all sorts of incredible looking Polish food around the table. And uh, I tried something completely new, uh, Jaeger pork schnitzel. And I'm super excited. What is, is this just applesauce? Yes. Okay. I was, it's like, common with pork. It's what? Common with pork. Oh, okay. Yeah, sounds good. Potato pancakes, looks good. 